Hello everyone and welcome back to BeamNG Drive. Today I'm gonna show you how to configure and host a BeamNP multiplayer server with mods using the online interface of assettohosting.com. It's a website where you can order your own BeamNP or Assetto Core server and it has a really user friendly online interface. So let's make our BeamNP server. I feel the power. So this is the user interface you can see after you log into the server. The first thing we need to do is uh, configuring the server. Go to the config menu. Here you can change the name of the server. And then we need an OS key. You can get it from keymaster.beamp.com. The link will be in the description. If you are on the site, just click on the login with discord button. Then connect your Discord account with BMP. And then in the left menu, go to Keys. And you will see a key here. Copy that. And paste it here. The next thing we can set up is the privacy of the server. By default, the server is not private, so it means that if I start the server, it will be visible in the server browser in the game. But if you don't want it, just turn it on. Then we have maximum cards and maximum players. Maximum players, of course, means how much player can join to the server. And maximum cards means how much vehicle each player can spawn on the server. And then we can select the map. Here are all the default BMNG maps, but I'm gonna show you how to add the custom maps. And then you can give a description for your server. And here you can customize the look of this server interface by using CSS. And if you are ready with all the modifications, then just click on save. And now the basic configuration is ready. But if you want to add the mods to the server, then you need to go to the content menu and you can upload the mods to the server by simply dropping these files here for example i'm gonna now upload the new hierarchy ccf the upload process may take a while of course it depends on your upload speed and after you uploaded the mod it is visible here and if you want to delete it from the server, just click on the delete button. But now it's time to upload also a map mode. For example, I'm gonna upload the river highway mode. And after the map mode is uploaded, go to the maps menu. And here you can add the map by making a new line and typing slash levels slash and then it is advisable to have a look at the naming of the map, like open up the file and then open the levels folder. And then the name of the level will be the name of this folder. And then type slash info dot json. And then click on save. And after you added the map here, go back to the config menu and then you can select this map. Click on save and now go to server control. Here you can see the terminal of the BMP server program. And if you want to start the server, just click on start. We can also enter commands by typing into this input menu and then click on send. Now the server is started, so let's have a look at it. For joining, let's copy the IP address. In BMNG go to direct connect, paste it here, and then we will also need the port number which is uh, separated from the IP address with a column, paste it here, then click on connect, and then as you can see the mods are downloading from the server, if it shows up this error in mod manager windows then don't worry it actually means that the mods are working i don't know if it's just me who got these errors all the time but 
the game is working so there is no problem and now we are loaded into the server as you can see is the river highway the modded map i uploaded and now i'm also able to spawn the mod cards i uploaded to the server yes here is the hirochi ccf so basically that's it we have a working server where you can play with your friends or with your youtube community but there are some more uh, useful features for example in the top right corner if you click on a profile icon you can update your password here and here you can log out from this account and you can also add uh, more accounts to the server just go to the accounts menu and click on the make open button if the server is not opened then it means that only you will be able to log in with the admin account and then click on add account and here you can type the username of this new account and then you can select what permissions this new account will have and this will be the password for the new account so after you made it and clicked on add new user you can send the username and this password to your friend or to the person you want to give access to this server and then after they log in with this automatically generated password they will have to change their password and there is one more feature that can be useful go to the current config menu and here you can see the configuration of the server as the configuration file it can be useful for example if you later want to use the same configuration on the website or on your own server then you can simply just copy that configuration and save them in a file and this is everything you need to know thank you for watching this video and thanks for assettohosting.com for giving us a free 25 slot server for making this tutorial if you have any questions just write it in the comments and see you in the next video.